Hey everybody, it's the Panoptical Poet here. I was spending some time in Caslow this weekend, so I decided to stop at Mirror Lake on the way home and read you a poem. Um, I'll read it and then I'll talk about it a little bit. It doesn't have a title yet. This one was actually just written in the last week, so kind of exciting. Even if you visit the same body of water a hundred times over, it will be different each time you go. Weathering of each season, changing the placement of rocks, trees growing a little taller than they were the year before in an effort to keep their leaves in the path of the sun. No matter how familiar a riverbank feels, nature is an eternal provider of exciting surprises, helping to break up the comfort of familiar monotony that comes with a life lived beside rivers, contemplating the character of their currents. Um, when I was writing that, I was just thinking about, like, I I wanted to slow my life down a bit when I got back to the Kootenays, because I think in a capitalist, colonialist society, productivity is so overvalued, and a lot of us get caught up in that. And uh, I was just listening to a great song by Anthony Vincent, actually. I love him. If you haven't checked him out already, you should. Heavy metal motivation guru. But anyway, one of his recent songs, I felt like it was almost written for me, because he's talking about, like, rest up because you know you will be more productive if you rest up and that's something I've really been working on so I do spend a lot of time now beside rivers because I mean we are made up of a lot of water and as humans you know and so is our planet and I was watching a documentary last night that was talking it was referring to water as the lifeblood of the planet you know and so I find that a very calming place to be and um I don't know, I, there's so many things on my mind right now, but people are so, a lot of people are just clinging to traditions and old ways in a way that I think is really unhealthy. And I just, I was thinking about how if I visit the same river spot, like I said, a hundred times over, you know, it's, it's always going to change. And that's a good thing. Um, I was going to use the word progress, but that's not really the right word because again, you know, I love, I love writing in English, but I guess words have kind of multiple meanings sometimes, and it's, sometimes we confuse each other, but, you know, this poem was really about just how the fact that nature is constantly changing is part of what makes it so beautiful, and just, you know, get out and recharge next to a river, because it's one of the best things you can do for yourself. But um, anyway, I feel like this video has been a little bit rambly. Um, like I said, there's so much going on in my head right now. I've been really thinking about um, the lenses that we look through at life, and I'm hoping to put out some poetry about that. But for now, I thought um, I would stop at Mirror Lake today, and this is a place I haven't been for years, and it's changed a lot, but it's still super beautiful. They have a really nice campground here. I'm sitting on one of the docks that you can use for swimming in the lake, so a beautiful space to come and check out if you're in the Kootenays. And on that note, I think I'm going to end it there. Stop ranting and say Panoptical Poet out. Have a great day.